next, a UFC lightweight division bout. Man, is it good to see a striker of this caliber make the walk to the UFC octagon tonight. Really decorated on the feet, and no surprise, he's definitely interested, Joe, in keeping this fight standing. We'll see if he can put on a striking clinic tonight. Takedown defense will be a weapon of use if he can keep the fight upright. Scary for the opposition tonight. This guy is an excellent striker. What he wants to do is utilize his footwork, his takedown defense, and land hard strikes to get the victory. So here is Conor McGregor making the walk once again, the only simultaneous two-division champion in UFC history, and really a guy who has taken the sport by storm. His win over Jose Aldo, Nate Diaz, most recently Eddie Alvarez. Remarkable what McGregor has accomplished in a short time in the UFC. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan favorite combination. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. So more than 10 years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Pete LeVay. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the sold out arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. <laughs> This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 146 pounds. Fighting out of Bangkok, Thailand, Assassin! And now, we his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, three losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor McGregor. Okay, protect yourself at all time. Will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back this has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go down right now. Ready? Here we go. So here is Conor McGregor yet again. You hear the Irish fans going bananas. There is no atmosphere in the fight game at present. Right like Conor McGregor inside this UFC octagon. Immediately, Conor taking control here of the center of the octagon. Check that one. Joe, how do you think he approaches this challenge tonight? One thing to look out for in this fight are the counter shots of Conor McGregor. Nice inside leg kick. Tagged him. That one hurt. And he connects with the punch there. That's again the experience. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a 
huge block. Switching stances here. Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got cracked with that jab. He was almost moving into it. So let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. McGregor gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Oh. He is hurt. Oh, look at that. Oh. Left hand. Oh, oh he caught him on the body. He's got right here. Body kick, look at that. Oh, and he eats a shot. Going for the single leg right now. Now goes in and secures the takedown. And he establishes full mount. Big punch from the bottom. Just over three minutes to go now. He's going for an arm bar here. He's got the arm here. Now he's gonna throw his leg over. He's got it here. Throw the leg over the face. It's very close here. Any second now he might have to tap. That arm bar is very, very deep. That's it. And there it That's is. It. An excellent job in setting up the arm bar and getting the tap. Yeah, that is some high-level Brazilian jiu-jitsu right there. Just the way he transitioned to secure the arm up against his body and ultimately force the tap. High-level stuff out of that young man here tonight. And here's the end. And one more time from this angle, we can see that arm bar locked in tight for the tap. And let's watch it here one more time. Deep submission and the tap. So there he is, your winner by submission. That is a finish they will likely be talking about for some time. Big win, major statement made to the rest of this division. Ladies and gentlemen, the referee Eve Devine has called a stop to this contest. At two minutes, 16 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out, the no is Hunter McGregor! Well, doubt this man at your own peril. The notorious Conor McGregor gets his hand raised yet again. You see the celebration is on with his chief corner, John Cavanaugh. A massive, massive moment in a career that has had so many of them for the notorious Conor McGregor. Going to be interesting to see how he moves forward after another big win here tonight.